Hello everyone, and welcome back to Dayland and my beautiful, beautiful little planet where apparently I am currently starving. So let's do something about that. It looks like I have a brand new berry that has just popped right off of my bush. So let's go ahead and eat one. Oh, that is just so cute. Okay, so I'm definitely going to need to eat a little bit more. But thankfully, we have been growing more things inside of my field. And we actually have the ability to hopefully add a kitchen to my new little house. Look at how cute it is. I am so in love. I mean, just look at it. Look at it. I am so in love with this tiny little wooden house. It is just adorable. I wonder if I can upgrade it as time goes on and I get more resources. But we have added a workshop into the house. And hopefully, I will learn how to unlock more items as time goes on. I'm trying to make myself some fabric to complete a quest for a very mysterious merchant who actually came by on his spaceship, which is kind of amazing to think about. Here I am in space and look at how beautiful it is. And there's a bunch of merchants who come by on their spaceships to come and get things from me, which is just so amazing. Oh, and is my wheat ready to harvest? Not quite yet. Almost there. Do I have any extra water? <gasps> I do have some extra water inside of the well. So let's go ahead and water my wheat. Oh, that's so cute. And I got a little experience for it. Is it going to make the wheat ready to harvest? <gasps> I think it is. Maybe I can make some bread. I just need to get the kitchen done too. Oh, look at that. That is so cute. Okay, let's go ahead and harvest this up, uh, which means I'm going to need to change tools. There we go. All right, got my little hoe out. We can go ahead, dig up this wheat. Nice. That was a lot of experience too. And I'm going to want to plant some more of it, I think. I also want to make sure I have some cotton seeds. Oh no, I used up all my cotton seeds. I used up all of my cotton seeds in order to make the fabric, the thread and the fabric that we already have done. So that was a little bit of a mistake and I'm going to have to figure out what to do because uh, I need more cotton seeds. Will there be a merchant who stops by, I wonder, like one I can actually shop from? Huh. Well, we'll figure it out. But all right, let's review our quest because I do have a lot of quests for things that I need to do. We need to light a torch in the campfire. We need to make some fabric for the magician lock. We need, whoop. Hey, she's back. All right. So it looks like our friend is finally back and she might actually have some information about our planet because she did some research on our little planet last time. So let's come over and see what she has to say. All right. Oh, and there she is on the other side. Hey, welcome back. Hey. Now I need to get information on the monsters. There's a special, uh, there's a species of nocturnal bats. I need you to get a sample of their wings. You mean I'm sharing this tiny planet with nocturnal bats? What? I shall take them on and I will be victorious. Okay, he is like a born little hero. He is so cute. I love him. All right, so we need to get a bat wing for Moon to analyze. But where are the bats? I've not had to deal with these bats yet. So many mysteries. All right, hopefully she'll have some answers for us in the future. All right, well, we get a little alerts from our cool crystal that we're wearing on our chest whenever there is an issue. Uh, so I guess I'm just gonna go ahead and carry on like normal until I get an alert that there's a little bat. Because, I mean, I don't have a cave, do I? Maybe I need to like try, well, what's, what's behind our spot over here? Oh, a mushroom, nice. What is over here? A little rock. But yeah, I don't think we have like a cave. Whoa, what? What? <gasps> I can just come over here and apparently I can get rocks off of, look at that. I can get rocks off of the spot around my my waterfall. I didn't know that. I hope I, I don't like destroy my waterfall though. That would be a little bit of a pain. But all right, what else can I do? Let's plant a couple more trees because we're going through, we're going through the trees really quickly. And I'm gonna need a lot of wood. I just have a feeling I'm gonna need like a ton, a ton of wood. So let's gather up some seeds. Let's cut down this tree so that I can get the seed behind it. Nice. I'm getting a little tired, so we might have to go to bed soon. It's just so peaceful here. Like I, I literally cannot imagine a more peaceful setting to be able to have a little home out in space on a beautiful little planet. And I feel like we're, we must be some sort of little hero. So hopefully we'll find out what we're the hero of soon. 
And can I plant some more wild berry trees? Raspberry bushes? I can! Oh, I want to have just this little, this little cluster of bushes over here behind our waterfall. That would be very nice. So I can come and collect up some more berries, more raspberries. Oh, it's just so peaceful and pretty. It's, it's so relaxing. I've done so many adventures where I am farming and taking care of my home and trying to uncover mysteries, but this is just so utterly enchanting and relaxing. I, I really love it. All right. And I've actually been thinking I should probably try to grow an, or to grow, to build a new well so that I can make sure that I'm actually using everything. And it's not that hard to build a well. So let's try building a new well right over here so that it can be closer to the water. There we go. Nice. And now can I go ahead and, oh, that's right. You can upgrade these fields as well, but I don't want to upgrade. I just want to be able to, oh no, there's meteors coming. Get away from my house. <laughs> You guys can land over here, okay? Okay, there's more meteors. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Where did the other meteor land? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to check and make sure that it didn't smush my house. Um, let's get more, whoops, I meant to do wheat, but it looks like we're growing some carrots, that's fine. Uh, and is there, yes, there's water in here. So I can hurry the carrots up a little and gain a bit more experience. Whew, and actually I'm kind of tired. Huh, well, Maybe I can come over here and make a torch. I don't have any torches. Well, I thought I could. Can I make a torch over here? I can. All right, let's go ahead and craft up a torch and we can at least complete that quest now. So, the power of fire. Oh, he's so cute. But what am I gonna do with it? Here's a mushroom. There we go. Oh, and another mushroom. Wow. Look at all the mushrooms that popped up because of these meteors. That's really fine, and we can break these open. There we go. They're so pretty, and apparently these crystals are very important. All right, so there's that. Did I complete? Yay, I completed that quest then. So I still need to make a fishing rod and catch fish from the lake for Bram, and I need to improve my uh, cabin by adding a kitchen. And I need to figure out how to actually make metals. I'm not really sure how to make metals, so hopefully I'll learn soon. Let's see. Are, are these done growing? I think they are. Oh, hey, all right, all right. Wait, no, I don't wanna, I don't wanna do that. I, I really don't wanna do that. Okay, but I want this guy to land. I need to clear a land. This is kind of cool. You have to like clear the rocks out of the way to have a nice landing site. And I totally did not want to make a new fire pit. There. Oh, thank goodness I could cancel it. Hello, good sir. There we go. Oh, and that's right. We can sell and buy from him. Let's talk to him again. You still do not have the objects you need to complete the chore. I, I actually really desperately need more cotton. Yes. All right. He does have cotton. I am so relieved. Uh, oh, and he has metal. <gasps> Okay, I'm going to need that. I'm really, really going to need that. Um, okay, so I need some cotton. Just just maybe one for now. Uh, and I don't... Oh no, I don't have enough money. I don't have enough money. Ah! Okay, and let's try to sell to him. What do I have to sell? Oh, here, I'm going to sell the sunflowers. He really likes that. I'm going to sell this stuff and the poisonous toadstool. And let's just go ahead and sell all of the silver ore because I need whatever we can do. Here, and you can have some mushrooms too, sir, if you would like. Uh, Cause I really, really, oh wow, that's a lot actually. I really need to be able to get some of that metal, but how much do I need? All right, I have 40 seconds to figure it out. So for the kitchen, I need 50 stone and four more metal. Okay, got it. Let's come over here and we're gonna buy four more metal. So can I get four? Maybe, one, two, three, four. Oh, I can just get enough. Okay. And I think that's everything I need for now. All right. Thank you very much, sir. Um, let me see if I have anything else I can offer you. I don't think so. I think I want that last metal. I really do. So let's see. Maybe if I get... Oh, there we go. And I can plant the cotton. Oh, no. My energy is out and I'm hungry. All right. All right. Quick sell. Um... I can sell some more carrots. I do have some carrots. I, I could sell a little bit more wheat. Here's my fungus. He really likes fungus, so I'm just gonna sell all of it to him. Uh, there we go. 
And that's enough, thank goodness, that is enough to buy that last metal from him. Whew, I think that's gonna be super important. All right, and let's go ahead, and now I'm down to just carrots, but it should be fine. And this is fantastic! I should be able to build myself a new kitchen now and get some of the upgrades that I need done. But for now, I need to go ahead and sleep. And he's probably gonna be gone when we wake up. But that is so cute! I love, love, love the little ship. It just lands. Hello, sir! So he's leaving now. Oh, that's so cute! All right. He's leaving now, but I am full of energy. We can actually go ahead and sow some more cotton seeds. They take forever to be ready to go, but I'm going to need a lot of that in order to make the thread to make the fabric for him. And hey, I mean, technically, wasn't that our very first order? It's kind of cool to have a responsibility that we need to tend to. Uh, let's get this water to make it go faster. Because we're like little farmers. Little itty bitty, teeny tiny, like way station farmers. I love watching the, the way the water has such a cool effect. That's really fun. All right, let's actually gather all of this. There we go. And I'm gonna cut down this tree. Uh-oh, what's going on? Oh, it's just dawn. <laughs> Every time I think I'm about to get completely blasted away. There we go. Completely, no, 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 don't you dare destroy that, you silly goose. There we go, grab some water. Ah, much better. Oh, meteorites! They were coming! Okay, quick, over here! You guys can land over here! Wow, look at that big rock! I wonder if it'll reveal, like, some sort of... Some sort of, um... Gosh, there they went! Was my little planet okay? Is there actually a cave here that I just haven't found yet? Oh, I think we lost one of the meteorites! It smashed apart when it hit this big boulder spot. So I'm gonna have to remember to be careful about where they go if I want to use them. There's enemies close by! Okay, where are they? There's an enemy! Did it come with the meteorite? It probably came with the meteorite. Alright, there's a mushroom. Let's see. Oh, it's over here! <gasps> it's the bat! Alright, are you guys ready for this? We gotta punch him in the face! He's pretty strong, but I think we can handle- Oh boy! Maybe we can't handle this. Come on! Sorry, you, you're really cute! You're really cute, but apparently you landed with the meteorite. Come on! I just have to punch him. Oh, I really need to make a forge. Oh no, he, he used confusion on me? <gasps> run! Okay, we're gonna have to just run until we feel a little better. But this is so cute, the little guy. Oh, hello mushroom. I'm just gonna pick this while we wait. All right, so we're confused right now, but I wanna stay near our enemy so that we we're ready to tackle him. There we go, it's over. Get him. You're so cute! I would keep you as a pet in the rafters of my house if I could. But I, I think you're a little more aggressive than that. Alright, and we managed to get the bat wing! Nice! Now we can turn that in when she comes to visit. And let's actually get some of these rocks because I want to upgrade our kitchen soon. Found some minerals. There we go. And as much as like I would love to leave the little rocks, it's kind of nice to be able to tidy up. But we definitely need to take care of tons and tons of these if I'm going to get enough stone to upgrade our house. So, I mean, I guess I shouldn't be surprised. Oh, I actually found a piece of metal on my own. I didn't know I could do that. Nice. But I guess I shouldn't be surprised by all the rocks on my tiny planet. We apparently have enough gravity we can live on it and have a little bit of an atmosphere. So maybe all these rocks are just sort of like meteorites that have arrived. Is this a really big rock? It sure is! It might take a lot of work to get rid of. Oh boy, maybe maybe you can't ever get rid of it? <gasps> wow, I think I found some gold! Oh, what? I want to see that. I did! I found some gold ore. How cool! And I think I did find some metal, which is adorable. Alright, let's get this rock. Get out of here, little rock. There you go. <gasps> oh! It's the fisher guy! He's coming back! Look, and we have a newly cleared space where we can welcome him. I don't have his fish yet, but hopefully he'll forgive me. This is so fun. Hello, hello! You do not have the objects you need to complete the chore. No, not yet, but I do have some things I could sell you. And, oh, he actually likes pine nuts and will buy them from me. That's really cool. He'll buy my carrots, he'll buy the mushrooms. I don't think it's 
quite for as good a price as the other guy will buy it for. But what can I actually buy from him? <gasps> the larva! I need those in order to get him the fish. Oh, that's fantastic. All right, I'm going to grab a few of these. Uh, he also has bread and milk and cheese. Maybe one day I can make those things too. And new trees! Oh, I'm definitely gonna need some of these. I really want to grow some new trees. That, that sounds fun. And I definitely need more of the larva. Because I need to do fishing. Uh-oh. I don't have enough- wait, do I have enough money? I don't have enough money! <laughs> How do I take back what I was trying to- uh, okay, let's sell something. Well, I could sell him these mushrooms then. Because they seem like they sell for quite a bit. And because you never know when they're going to come back, I want all of that larva. I would like at least two of those acorns. I can always wait and get more from them. And let's treat ourselves, maybe, to something yummy. Let's get a little bit of cheese. Let's get some space cheese, because that sounds amazing. So there we go. All right, let's eat some space cheese. That'll help us heal up and, oh, that's so much better. I feel so much more full. Look at how he looks like he has a bunch of little mushrooms like a fairy ring around his ship. That is so cute. And now, next time, I'll actually be able to go and do some fishing for him. Uh, and I think he's gonna, he's gonna leave before I can do the fishing, so we'll wait. But I have new seeds, new fishing, new, new little wells. This is fantastic. I think we're gonna get quite a bit done. Oh, I love this. I absolutely love this, guys. This is... This is just so cute and charming, and I hope you are having a great time with it too. And I can't wait to see you next time as we continue to upgrade our little home and see what adventures are waiting for us. So I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye!